Yes. Yeah. We'll call a meeting to order. Any public comment?
Right, and we're at well, we're just now getting to that point. Right. Um, so approve it. Right. I've, I've got a couple of things I want to talk about real quick. Uh, as of today, I know the water district, the school, and the county have all approved our budget. But the county did have a condition in approving our budget. I want to address that real quick. Okay. We had asked them uh, a few different times to consider taking over the grounds maintenance for the building. So as a conditional uh, approval, they asked that we remove the grounds maintenance from our budget for 2017 and that they would take it over starting in 2017. I think actually it may become effective immediately, it's what I've been told, but I don't know that for a fact, but I know for sure at January 1st of 2017. Okay. And I have... Sounds like a good plan. I have an updated approved budget. Uh, I didn't print a ton of copies because it's a very minor change from the one that you, you've already got a copy of if you'd like to look at it. Uh, and it reflects that change. It reflects the change, and I think it removes $2,250 from our okay. budget. So the approved budget would be uh, slightly different than the one that we originally proposed, but it would be going down. And, uh, That's $7,93. Right. Very good. We've all looked through the budget. So I would entertain a motion that we approve the 2017 uh, Summer Hill County Credit District budget. Do I have a second? Second. Any further discussion about the budget? All in favor say aye. 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 The AC units. We have two AC units. We have three total on our building. We have two AC units that have been here since the building was completed in 1994. Um, they're still functioning. One of them is kind of being held together literally by bay bailing wire. I mean, you can walk out there and look at it, but, but they are still functioning. So these are not something we have to do today, but this is something that we would like to do soon because I anticipate that both these, based on the last uh, gentlemen that we got out to repair them. I, I believe that both these are going to be cutting loose relatively soon. And, uh, you know, at this point, they're 22 years old. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I mean, they're approaching the end of their useful life for sure. That's longer than most of them last. That, that's correct. And we went out and uh, I looked for a couple of different bids. Unfortunately, the only bid I actually received back at this point was from H&S air conditioning and heating. Uh, I don't know very much about H&S. I know they are considered to be local. I know that they are, uh, uh, did some work. Apparently at some point on our building, I think when we did the add-on, Mr. Staples used them to do the air conditioning that was replaced here. So. Um, that's who we've gotten a bid from. We've asked for a more detailed copy of the bid, but at this point have not received one. Uh, I had him break it into parts. He basically said that we could, you know, change them at different times, but essentially $6,500 a piece would be what it's going to cost uh, to change each of these. Uh, we could do one now, we can do one after the first of the year if you choose to. That keeps us pretty close to what we have budgeted each year. Or we could take the funds out of reserve and do them both at one time. It's whatever is your pleasure. We can wait until they actually go out. Does this say five ton AC? Yeah. It does. My, my inclination with them 20 years old is to replace <laughs> both of them. You have the maintenance on them. They're, they're going to be inefficient as it is. And uh, I, I, I don't know. Uh, I would uh, think it would be advantageous to get them both in place. They've gone out several times. Uh, it seems like every year they go out. Yeah, we generally every spring at least once yeah. have something that yeah. we have to repair. But, but they have been relatively minor. This was one of the larger repairs we had done. We had to have a fan unit replaced and some things. But still, I mean, they are functioning. So I, <coughs> it's whatever y'all would like to do. Do whichever I ask. We have the reserves to do it. We've got roughly 122000 in reserve, which is just slightly over three months worth of working capital. So. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. 
Well, go ahead. Okay. Uh, but I'm going to suggest that I'd rather see, I would prefer to see more than one, a single bid. Okay. Uh, if you will contact the auditor's office at the county, because we've been through this process, mm -hmm. and they're they can uh, give you more bid bidders. Okay. But we want to take this, or do we want to approve? It? We can approve an amount and let him bid it uh, to, to work within that amount and we didn't have to bring it back to the bank. Okay, we make a motion that we approve the, the funds for $6,500 for each unit for both units uh, to be replaced on the building pending the uh, reception of another bid that doesn't exceed this one. Very good. Do I have a second? Second. Any further discussion? Uh, just like, are, are they basically just going to move the outside unit and the in, remove the outside unit and the inside unit and replace them? Yes. And just move them back up? Yes. Okay. Yeah, there would be no duct work or any changes in anything except for the two units themselves. Wiring's already three phase all the way? Right. Any further discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Chief Treasurer reports. Um, I don't have a ton to report this time because most of our report has been on pending litigation. But currently, which seems odd that I'm going to say this, but at this point we don't have any pending litigation because uh, women is technically not pending at this time. They have not filed an appeal, so at this time there's nothing to really discuss on that. Um, they still have, you know, a number of days to work with before they are required by law. When is the deadline? Well, it's a moving target currently because they've actually filed uh, basically an appeal to the final decision, which potentially there's going to be a hearing on that. And at that point, it could restart their 30-day clock. And then at the end of the 30 days, they have the opportunity to file a new trial. So that more than likely would get denied, but it could potentially restart their clock again. So anywhere between 14 days and 75? Yeah. Right. Kind of at the mercy of the court. We are set a new, new deadline. So. Absolutely. And we have, to, we have to hear what Coach Neal's going to do at this point as far as the findings of fact. Are <coughs> he could tell them, you know, look, I've made my findings of fact. There's no need for us to get to continue forward with them, which is a, a fairly high probability of that. But, but we don't know because we haven't seen an answer to this. Okay. So we're waiting for them to make Basically, at this point, we, we're handcuffed until somebody does something. Okay. And as far as the, I, I do want to touch on the fact we did send notices out uh, on May 1st. Um, the notice period comes to an end today. So this is the last day to file a, a residential protest notice without you know, uh, it being timely. So um, we'll get through today and find out for sure how many protests we have. But quite frankly, they're extremely low at this point. I think we have less than 100 currently times. That could change over the next few days because a lot of people still don't know about mental health. As of right now, they're, they're extremely low. And our response this year was about what we expected. It wasn't above average, but it was probably average. It definitely wasn't below average on our response to our this year. I think that's all I have. Uh, the staff report chain any further questions? I'm sorry, John. I have none. I have none. I would entertain a motion to adjourn. So moved. I have a second. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Thank y'all. Mm -hmm.